Hi, this is problem number 11 on uh, equilibrium of forces. This is problem on sphere. A sphere weighing 100 Newton is fitted in a right angled uh, notch. W is given 100 Newton. E is fitted in a right angled notch as shown in figure. If all contact surfaces are smooth, determine the reaction at contact surfaces. Okay. We have to determine reaction at the contact surfaces. Let me uh, call this point as A. Here we have one contact surface now. Let me call this contact surface as contact surface A. Okay. Now we have to determine reaction at the contact surface. Always we know that the reaction will be perpendicular to the plane of the surface. Re reaction at contact surface A we have to find. Okay. Now the sphere is also connected with another cable. Okay. Let me assume T as T as tension force induced in the cable. Tension force induced in the cable. So here in this system there are uh, total three forces tension force in the string self weight of the sphere and reaction at the contact surface A. Okay. Now after writing the reactions find horizontal inclination of the reaction at the contact surfaces. So you just draw on the horizontal here. Here this angle is given as 40 degree. Write the angle. It is 40 degree. The overall angle between reaction and the contact surface is, surface is 90 degree. Therefore, the remaining angle that you get is 50 degree. This angle is 50 degree. Fifty degree. Okay. So, horizontal inclination of reaction at contact surface A is 50 degree. Okay. There is tension force. Okay. And what is the horizontal inclination of the tension force? It is given 70 degree. Horizontal inclination of the tension force is given as 70 degree. Now you write the free body diagram FBD FBD free body diagram. Initially, the sulfate of the sphere always sulfate acts in vertically downward direction. Sulfate is given as 100 Newton and there is tension in string T. How does that thing in along left top corner? Okay. From the same point, okay, you write the same force with the same direction like this T and its horizontal inclination is how much? 70 degree. 70 degree. And there is reaction at A. How it is acting? It is acting along the right top corner from this point. Okay. Away from the joint, you have to write like this. Ra. And horizontal inclination of Ra is how much? It is 50 degree. Okay. Therefore, on this side, overall angle will be how much? 90 plus 50, 140 degree. On the other side, 90 plus 70, 160 degree. So, the remaining angle here is how much? 360 minus 160 minus 140, you will get the angle as 60 degree. 60 degree. Now, you can just apply Lamy's theorem to get Ra and T. Applying, applying Lamy's theorem. T divided by sin 140. T divided by sine of opposite angle 140 is equal to 100 divided by for 100 Newton opposite angle is 60 degree sine 60 degree 
is equal to R A divided by opposite angle sin 160. Sin 160. Consider first and second equation, you will get T 100 sin 140 divided by sin 60. Therefore, T is equal to 334 Newton. Then considering second and the third equation, you, you can solve for RA that is 100 sin 160 divided by sin 60. By this, you will get reaction at the contact surface A as 177.71 Newton. Okay. So, to this, we got reaction at the contact surfaces and tension in the stream T. Okay. So, this completes the problem. Thank you.